Fish are tough. Holy cow. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I got my friend Jackson here and we're gonna be fishing in this pond because it is time to get our pet bass for the pond back home. So we need to get a bass that's about probably four or five inches long, just small enough so that it feels like it has a nice big home and also so it has at least three or four months of growing space in the pond. So we gotta get the perfect size fish and this is the pond to do it, stock full of small bass. So without further ado, let's dive right in and start fishing. Fishing reel and for bait, we're gonna be using an artificial brush hog, Texas rigged with a small offset hook. Look guy. Mm. Got a little guy. I think he's a little bit too big though. I think we need about uh, two inches shorter for it to work. Guys, I just pulled this fish in and there's literally a chunk taken off its back and it's healed. That's so big. What? I, no. I think it's a snapper. Dude, and, and this fish survived. Dude, fish are tough. Holy cow. We got a fish, but I think he's just a tad too big. We've been fishing for a while, and this is the smallest one we got. I think we could do better. So I'm going to let him go, and uh, hopefully we catch another one. So we were fishing for our small bass for the pond. Turns out... We couldn't catch a small enough fish. We decided to go turtle hunting instead because these annoying turtles would just be looking at us while we're fishing. So we're like, why not? And so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna nab some turtles. Hopefully one that's small enough for the pond. That'd be absolutely insane. We're turtle hunting. <laughs> Get him. I got him. Let's go, oh, dude. Dude. Let's go. Check this out. That's sick. Bro. Oh. Dude, that's perfect size for the pond. Let's go. <laughs> dude, I didn't think I got him. I thought you missed him for a second. Dude. I don't I think this is a is this a painted turtle? Yeah. No way. That's so cool. We got our turtle. Put him in the bucket. Let's see what others we can find. All right, there's one out there. Jax is gonna go for it. That one's out there a little bit. Oh, he's too far. I couldn't reach him <laughs> to go in. <laughs> Maybe you just gotta go in, Jackson. There's no <laughs> Come on. <laughs> no shot. Okay, there, there's, a, there's a turtle. <laughs> and he's a little too far from my net. So. Oh no, where'd he go? Oh. He went under. He's going in for it. What? Full Superman. Oh. Bro, he's not there anymore. He on. Alright, alright. You see that turtle out there? He's in. He's right there, right in the middle. Alright. There's only one way to do this. We'll wait for that car to drive by. All right, all right. This is it. Just, this is just it. send it. I'm sending it. Three, two, one. It's way too far. You got it. <laughs> you lay two, out, lay out for it. Two, one. <laughs> Did you get it? <laughs> <laughs> he didn't get it. <laughs> uh, I missed. <laughs> <laughs> he was ready, dude. He's like, come on in. <laughs> he was watching. He was like, oh, no. Good thing nobody saw that. <laughs> <laughs> Did not get it. Is that a turtle? Should I just, should I just check? Yeah, just <laughs> go for I'm it. I might as well just check. Just... <laughs> you get it. <laughs> Bro, it 
<laughs> you went in feet first. You had to get the net down. Well, it was kind of awkward. Hopefully, it looked better on camera than I think it did in real life. <laughs> I think next one, I need to go hands first because I'm like super clumsy. Yeah. There. Like, I don't even need this net, honestly. <laughs> what do you think? think you can catch it bare hand? This is for rookies, man. <laughs> you watch on YouTube, like, look at that little guppy wussy kid, man. Way out there. Look, 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 look. See that dot out there? I know for a oh, fact. Oh, yeah, I see it. I know for a fact. Right there. You zoomed in, bro? Yeah. Oh, no. It just went so... under. Wait, that's got it. That, that dot right there? Yeah, I see it. One. That has to be. You gotta, go, going for you gotta it. go quick. He bites my finger off. No, I did it for you. No. No way. No way. No way. No way. No shot, dude. No way. Dude. Dude, you can't make this up. We got you it. You can't make this up. Let's go. Things are bad. Oh, the thing's a tank. <laughs> okay, man. I really don't know what to say. I can't believe you got it. But that that's a first. I, that so there was no way. I jumped and he was gone. Yeah, I know. I, was in the I air. know. And then I landed and then I just like felt around. And, and then he was in him. between my legs. <laughs> you <laughs> rolled you rolled over. Yeah, he was in between my legs. And I grabbed him. Dude, that is crazy. That's a beautiful painted turtle it's though. Alright, we're gonna let this uh, beautiful painted turtle go. So we can catch him again and make him look like a fool. Come on, Jimmy. I don't know. I thought, I thought it was a myth that turtles were slow. There we go. Oh, there we go. It's like... <laughs> that was too deep. <laughs> that was too deep. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> There's one there. Wait. Edge of the moss. Dude, that's mine. That is my turtle right there. Come Go on. head first, dude. Head first. <laughs> you gotta go hands hands first at least. <laughs> you can't make this up. You <laughs> Dude. <laughs> I think you stunned them and they don't know what's going on and they gotta just sit there. Anyway guys, I'm getting cold. I am uh I'm pleased with what just happened. So I'm gonna head back home, take our little tiny turtle, put him in the pond, and uh see how everything goes. Um my plan is to basically just let him go in the pond and uh if he wants to leave he can leave but uh my theory is it'll be a nice place for him to just chill out so he might stay there but all right guys let's head back home it is the next morning it was too dark last night to let him go but uh take a look at him now we got a turtle we got a pond and uh there's a couple things i want to do before i let him go so as you can see the pond has more than enough space for him but he definitely needs some more basking areas. So we're gonna take a couple rocks, set them in place so we can get up and sun himself. So as you can see, I got this little shelf where he could just chill out and sunbathe. And then I got this little cave under here, under the piece of slate. But under here, he can find some shade and plenty of places for him to get up. There he goes. So as you saw with this pond, there is no fence or anything. And so the idea is I'm just gonna let him hang out here. And if he wants to leave, he can get out and he can leave. But I had a friend who actually did this and the turtle just decided to stay, even when he had the chance to leave. I definitely need to get some like water hyacinth or some other like aquatic plants that have more shade before the lily pad grows up just so he has something to chill out in. Down the cave. Go. Okay, so Mr. Turtle is out of the pond and he's looking at me. So I don't know what that means. I guess we'll just see what happens.
So I set the camera up for like five minutes just to see what he does. And he already climbs out and goes up into this like viney plant over here. At this point, I'm just gonna let him do what he does. Like if he wants to leave, that's fine. But I think he can hear the waterfall. And if he goes out like into the yard, he probably could still hear the water, find it and come back if he wanted to. But honestly, it's up to him. We're gonna see what he wants to do. But on my part, I think I wanna make this pond have a little bit more like shade and cover for him. Because the pond I got him out of had like plants everywhere, moss everywhere. Like, so he was like comfortable in the water. So I think what I wanna do is go, I wanna go see if I can grab some water lettuce and water hyacinth, just so that he has some, when he's swimming around, he has some shade. These guys are called water hyacinth and they're floating plant. They got roots on the bottom and they're just super cool, amazing colors. And this will be perfect for the turtle, I think, because he could actually just chill right underneath him. So the turtle's got shade in the water, shade on land. He's got flowing water, also has minnows in there to eat too. I think it's a good place for him, but like I said, he has the ability to leave completely if he wants to. And sometimes they do that, sometimes they stay. So I'm not gonna ask you to name him because as of now, I literally have no idea if he's gonna stay or leave. I am a little skeptical because he's, he's not like a baby turtle. He's honestly pretty smart. He knows how to get out really easily. So he may leave. It is the hair.